Do you get faces like these when creating full-body portraits or images where the subject is at a distance, or even faces like these? When facing this challenge, it's a strong indicator that the After Detailer extension could be your solution. In this tutorial, we'll learn how to use the After Detailer extension to fix faces that look blurry or distorted. Let's start and improve some messed up faces. To assist in restoring faces and addressing facial issues using Stable Diffusion, you'll need to acquire and install an extension called After Detailer. Here's how you can do it. Navigate to the Extensions tab within Stable Diffusion. Go to the Install from URL subsection. Paste the official GitHub URL, which I will provide in the description. Click the Install button to install the extension. After the installation is complete, head to the Installed section. Click on Apply and Restart UI to restart the user interface. This step ensures the successful installation of the extension. Once the user interface has been successfully restarted, you'll notice an expansion panel as you scroll down in both the Text to Image and Image to Image tabs. When the After Detailer expansion panel is opened, it will appear similar to this. Before we delve into the After Detailer extension settings, we require an image featuring a blurred face. This image will allow us to showcase the effects and changes produced when activating the extension. To illustrate this, we'll craft a complete body portrait of a woman at a beach. Let's proceed by accessing the Text to Image tab within Stable Diffusion. Once there, you can select your checkpoint. For this particular demonstration, I've chosen the Realistic Vision checkpoint. With the checkpoint chosen, you can then move on to entering a prompt that effectively conveys the concept of a full body portrait. As part of the process, Feel free to fine-tune settings such as dimensions, the sampling method employed, and even the number of sampling steps. Now go ahead and click the Generate button to observe the outcome of the face. As evident, the generated full-body portrait lacks a natural-looking face entirely. It appears unnatural and distorted. Now let's move on to resolving this using the After Detailer extension. However, before proceeding, ensure you use the same seed image for the upcoming generation. This will ensure the usage of the image we just created. Now let's open the After Detailer extension. Initially, enable it by selecting the checkbox. Following this, it's time to choose an appropriate detection model from the model drop-down menu. The models are sorted into various categories, face, hand, person, and media pipe underscore face. In our case, we'll select the face model since our goal is to correct the face. Moving forward, we can proceed to the prompt sections. Within these sections, you can complete the positive and negative prompts. Here, your focus should be on the specific area you intend to rectify. For instance, in our example, our aim is to restore a distorted face, so our prompt could be something like this. Detailed face, Latina woman face. Additionally, you have the option to include Laura's inside the prompt section. Here, we will use the detail tweaker Laura to add more detail. When a prompt is left empty, the main prompt is utilized. In our scenario, we didn't input a negative prompt within the after detailer extension, so it will rely on our main prompt. With the extension activated and the settings configured, you can proceed by clicking the Generate button. As evident, the After Detailer executed an automated in-painting task and flawlessly corrected the facial features. To provide a swift comparison, here you have the opportunity to observe the image before and after the correction. The After Detailer extension in Stable Diffusion is a transformative solution for flawless facial restoration. It automates processes and empowers users for impeccable results. Embrace automation and elevate your images with the After Detailer extension in Stable Diffusion. I hope you've picked up something valuable that you can use in your future full-body portraits. Have an excellent day, and remember to subscribe to our channel and give the video a thumbs up. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.